One of the goals of classic fighters is to display aircraft that have not previously been seen in New Zealand. This year, Mustang ZK TAF underwent a cosmetic makeover just prior to the show, emerging from the workshop disguised as a completely different aircraft. The Mustang is often considered an American aircraft, primarily used by the United States Army Air Force in Europe during the later stages of the war. However, the aircraft was originally designed to a requirement issued by the Royal Air Force, and over 1,800 P-51s saw service with RAF fighter units. In late 1944, Mustang KM-272 was allocated to No. 19 Squadron RAF which at that time was based in East Anglia. The squadron had been providing close support for the Allied Army in France since the invasion on D-Day. Later in the year, the squadron also undertook long-range bomber escort missions from a base in Scotland. KM-272 was assigned to Flight Lieutenant Joe Dooley, who probably named the aircraft Dooley Bird. Until 1955, the RNZAF operated 30 P-51Ds in four regional territorial Air Force units. Of the three original RNZAF Mustangs that survive, two are in airworthy condition, one in the US and one in England. The third resides with a private owner in New Zealand. This Mustang, ZK TAF, was initially delivered to the US Army Air Force in 1945 and later served eight years with the Royal Canadian Air Force. In 1959, it returned to the US and after a succession of American owners, was brought to New Zealand in 1984.